Just Hello there. I was um, thinking about having a dinner party at some point over Christmas, and I was wondering if you could give me um, some specific information on what particular types of wines go with what specific types of food. Um, obviously, I know that red goes quite well with meat, meaty dishes and white with fish. But I was just wondering if you could expand on that, if there's any particular food groups that go with certain wines. Um, yeah, absolutely. I mean, what did you have in mind? What food was? Um, well, I was thinking mainly of maybe steak or lasagna, something quite meaty. Um, if, you, if you're looking at something with, uh, if you're looking at something big and meaty, like with a ragu. So if you're looking for steakers, there's particularly if it's like rarer. Look at something heavy like a Malbec or a Syrah. Uh, the Syrah can be French or Chilean. Um, if you're looking for something uh, sort of like lasagna, like Bolognese, try something uh, quite big in Italian, like one of the Valpolicellas or a Repasso. Okay, and for starters, I'm thinking of just having some like kind of light canapes. Um, yeah, um, yeah, yeah, a bit of fizz, a bit of prosecco. Yeah, prosecco. Yeah, a good place to start that. Okay, and for um, dessert, I was thinking of maybe having some sort of chocolate fondue or um, a strawberry cheesecake. I know they're quite different, so I was wondering what would be best for. Well, each if you're looking for um, if you're looking for a still wine. Then um, your rosé, sort of a lighter rosé, especially with the cheesecake. If you're looking for something deep with your chocolate fondue, you might want to consider a dessert wine or a port. Okay. And is there any um, particular um, going expanding on dessert wines at all? Would there would be anything you'd suggest to you the cheese board or anything like that for afters? So, if you're looking at a cheese board, then uh, if you've got any board aching about, if you want to stick with wine, use that. Failing that, get yourself a nice ruby port. Now with the dessert wine, it's pretty specific as to what's going to be on your cheese board. So if you've got anything like stilton you want something in a sauterne or something to that effect, and that'll knock off against your stilton. But to be honest, that can be a bit hit and miss. So if you're doing a cheese board, I'd use port if I were you, mate. OK. So it sounds like French wine uh, might be the best route to go down then. Is that right? Yeah, I mean, I mean if, typically... So traditionally, as we say, you know, traditionally, then you get the, the sort of the bigger Bordeaux, uh, kicking up with loads of it, kicking about at Christmas, tend to go with these sort of more mature cheeses. Okay. So if you're looking at a cheese board, that cheese board, that could dominate it. Unless you're looking to mix your cheese board, in which case you're going to mix your wine and then things get very complicated. But if, if you like it complicated, then you could do a different wine to do a, a different cheese, but... That, that's all on you, but... OK, sounds like you've uh, given me something to think about. Do you have most of these wines in store in the Derby? Uh, yeah, absolutely. If, if you want to nip in and have a chat, then I can, uh, I can point you around if you. OK, that's great. Thank you very much for your help.